and it took a good two and a half years to finally nail Mr. DiCaprio. I think Kate said that they just got along very, very well when they did the Titanic. She was, always wanted Leo. She said she'd been talking to Leo for an, two years now to come in and do this part. And I was very, I had to be very good about that. I couldn't, Leo's one of those people, if you bombard him with stuff, or if you try and get something from him, he just pushes you away and runs as far as he can in the opposite direction. So I had to be very, very good about how I mentioned this to him, when I would bring it up. You know, so every kind of year or so, I just throw it into a conversation. I'm like, did you ever read that script? It's really, it's really good. I think, um, I think it's definitely gonna happen. And just plant these little seeds. She sort of called me up and said, look, I want you to take a look at this script again. I think it's ready. My husband, Sam Mendes, is directing it. I think that for Leo, it's the opportunity to work with a director like Sam and the service of material like this. The dynamic between April and Frank's character was so, so powerful and so realistic. And I felt like, it really felt like you were a, a fly on the wall listening to an intimate relationship disintegrate. You don't hate me or anything? No. No, of course I don't. I've never read dialogue like this before in any type of film that I've ever, any type of script that I ever read. He's just a, you know, an astonishing actor. So um, pairing the two of them together, are the, 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 the two of our great actors of our time. Within literally months of him saying yes, we were making the movie because he had this, Leo had this window of time. Because you know, when Leo decided he wanted to do it, we were 10 weeks away from shooting. And it's a big movie, it's a period film, um, and suddenly we were in pre-production. So I, I needed to call someone who I knew and trusted could get it done starting, you know, yesterday.